Welcome to the Nicholas 11x12 technology. Today I'd like to demonstrate you a very simple and straightforward comparison in speed of an SSD and an HDD. I'll demonstrate you boot up and startup times. For the SSD I'm using the Corsair Force 3 120GB solid state drive. For the HDD I'm using the Western Digital KVR Blue 500GB SATA 6GB per second hard disk drive. The tests carried out will be completely identical and will even be carried out on the same exact computer system. On both drives I've installed Windows 8.1 Pro and the same programs. First we'll be testing the cold boot time, then the restart time, the Google Chrome and Mozilla Firefox startup time and last but not least the Sony Vegas Pro startup time. So let's get started. As you saw yourself, the SSD won overall, but the HDD did dangerously well too. The last time I performed such a test with the exact same drives, back in 2012, with Windows 7 as the operating system, the SSD won by far. This time however with Windows 8.1, we see a dramatic improvement in speed for traditional mechanical HDDs. In some aspects an HDD can be just as good or even faster in Windows 8.1 than an SSD. But still, I'd say the SSD still is the winner, but it's not really about winning here. It's how you combine these two different drives in order to get the best overall performance for daily tasks. The best combination for performance and storage would be an SSD for the boot drive with the web browsers for example and an HDD for large programs, games and data. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe and visit nicholas11x12techx.com to see videos there earlier than on YouTube.